Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Mika Apoptosis. Previously, I finished the prologue when I helped uh, when I helped Mika escape from prison. So apparently, the apparently the Cardinals have kidnapped her for her power, which isn't which is not okay. It's not okay at all. Five years ago, the goddess abandoned us. That was when Helg's gate opened up, and those things invaded our lands and murdered all of the humans their grotesque selves came across. That was when Princess Micaiah, our savior who has the blood of the goddess in their veins, created this castle to house all of the people she managed to save from those things. She dreams of the day when Every last one of those creatures will be sent back to hell where they belong and for all of us to live in internal safety. And we are here to help her fulfill that dream. Meeting her, the one who holds the power of the goddess in her hands, we know we have finally been rescued from this hell. Sure, why not? It is his journal. Long life the church. Hmm. Why we need not fear the devil by Castor Salvador? Daily news: Castor Salvador to take over position as head of Salvador family. The evening news: Does the Mazia exist or does he not? Theories abound. Good day, sir. Uh, hello. Good day, Mr. Lenine. The prince is still resting. Perhaps you'd like to check back later? Okay. Mr. Lenine, I think Miss Fleur was looking for you. Fleur? What does she want this time? Who knows? She should still be in her room. Alright, I got it. She should be resting at this time. I shouldn't disturb her. missing. Lee 9, have you seen it anywhere? Ugh, not again. Well, I have almost exactly two hours and 48 minutes to my next shift. Guess I can help you look for it. Uh, thanks a bunch, Lee 9. Jeez, can't the princess just water all these plants at one go using your powers or something? What a pain. Well, the princess is pretty busy keeping those things out of the house. Unless you want to abandon that duty. You've got a point there, Lenine. Hi, Mr. Lenine. How are you today? I'm alright. Okay, let's see if I can find... Let's see if I can find it. There it is. Huh? 
Eric seems rather grumpy today. Guess he must be hungry. Do you not have work to do like the rest of us, sir? It's not time for dinner yet, Lenine. Wee! I love food! <laughs> okay... I've... Yes, I found a fruit bowl, but it's not letting me... It's not letting me interact. I don't know why. Hmm. It's not letting me pick up. Hmm. back to it. Good day, Mr. Lenine. I heard from Miss Janelle that you don't like fairies very much. Is this true? <coughs> I just don't bother myself with them. Physician's clinic. Well, hello there, Mr. Lenine. Are you here for treatment? No, thank you. Of course you aren't. You never fall sick, boy. Young people these days sure aren't be as strong as you. Oh wait, then I won't have a. I won't have a job anymore. <laughs> Human behavior is all based on their brain's organic structure. With a little tweaking, it is possible to induce external influences. This is all theory, of course. Besides, such tweaking must be done on such a minuscule level it is impossible for a human physician to do it. The following people are not allowed in the clinic. Fleur, Isabel. I wonder why. Art room. Good day, Lenine. Do you want me to paint your picture? No thanks. Why is she not allowed in a, in a physician? Why is she not allowed in a clinic? Did she do something bad? Locked? Oh, I should say. Okay. This isn't real gold, is it? I don't know. A mix of male and female clothing. When the seagulls cry. Okay, so nothing much in that room. Possible fake gold and a little black haired girl by Castor Salvador. A reform for the church.
So you want to be the comic relief. Day 248. I like donuts. Uh, okay. <laughs> oh, hello, Mr. Lenine. I didn't see you there. <laughs> so there's the fruit bowl. Did you steal that fruit bowl from the kitchen again? Uh, well then I gotta go. See you later. Rainer, there's a bowl of fruit on your table. There's tooth marks on a plastic mango. I thought I told you many times that plastic fruit are not for consumption. Rainer, if you do not get out of bed right this instant, I'm going to throw you out of the castle. And the next time I see you, you are going to be a skeleton. Okay, okay, fine, I forgot. But everybody, but everyone makes mistakes. It is human to err and gracious to forget. For the sake of the goddess, Rainer, that's why I keep you away from small objects. Promise not to let Teresa know. Fleur will laugh at me forever. Surely she can't laugh at you forever. She'll forget about it eventually. Mr. Leonine. Okay, okay, fine. I'll forget about it. If you carry the bowl back to the dining hall like a good boy. Many thanks, Mr. Leonine. Hugs and kisses. Ciao! <laughs> I can't believe he did that. Whoopsies, my bad. Hey! Did he, did he just handcuff me? Now shout for real! What? Did he, what? Uh, what just happened? How could that guy never cease to amaze me? That guy went. Ugh. I guess I should tell that lady. Say you took the fruit bowl and tried to eat. What that little liar! So that's why. Yeah, he did, didn't he? Wait a minute. He said what? You do know that it's wrong to steal fruit balls, right? I know you're the prince's right hand man and all, but that doesn't excuse you. Wait, Rena was the one who. And then you have the audacity to come here. To come back here with that innocent looking face as if you had done nothing wrong. He hasn't! I don't get paid enough for this. Thanks to you, I had to replace the mango again. I'm gonna have a little war with him. Somehow, I doubt that. Cannon suddenly washed off to the bathroom. I wonder if he's alright? Jeez, can't the princess just water all these plants at one go using her powers or something? What a pain. Well, the princess is pretty busy keeping those things out of the house. Oh yeah, I already read that.
wasn't me. It was him. Ah, <sighs> die. He's going to pay. Can't believe he will lie. <laughs> Lenny. I was wondering where you've been, Lenny. Just in time. I was hoping you could help me with something. Why should I be running your errands? Because I said so. Anyway, Clara just kicked me out of her clinic. How rude. I need to give her a piece of my mind. Were you trying to steal medicine from the clinic again? I thought I told you you weren't allowed to do that. Mm. It's not fair. Why am I the only one banned from Clara's clinic? This is discrimination, I tell you. Isn't that a good thing, though? That means you get to enjoy personally minister healing from, the, from our princess when you get sick. That's not the point. I don't need direct healing. I need medicine and tonics. It's for the sake of science. It's for the sake of my research. Ah. None of you understand. Shh. How tragic. Shush. Anyway, I really, really, really need that draw of Antriquart for my Save the World potion. Will you help me out? Claire won't let me go anywhere near her clinic, and Rena refused to help me anymore. No. Even if, if even Rena has refused to help you, then you must have already gone too far. I refuse. But Lenny, I refuse. But Lenny, ugh. Never. I'll give you my tomatoes at dinner later. Are you honestly expecting me to give in with that? Tomatoes are exactly a rare com commodity around here. All of them. Deal. Really? Oh, Lenny, you're the best. Wow. This time, I'll make the perfect potion to destroy all those hell beings that terrorize our lands. If the princess can't do it, what makes you think you can? Besides, I'm just already thankful enough that she's keeping those things out of the castle. You never know until you try. Well, that's true. Whatever you say, just don't blow anything up, alright? The anti wire is in Gore-like bottle at the edge of Clara's desk. You won't miss it. Come back soon. Fleur will be raiding. I can't believe she bribed me with tomatoes. <sighs> I can't believe it. I really don't have a choice, do I? Wait, where am I going? Is this it? Well, you don't need anything, do you? Actually, I'm here to get some anti war for the princess. Do you have any to spare? Oh, no way, Lee and I. I know full well that the mistress is still asleep. She couldn't have given you any orders. Now you are here for treatment, or are you just trying to steal some of my homemade tomato paste? What? I'm not. Wait, is your homemade tomato paste any good? I knew it. Yes, this anti wolf would make the perfect shade of brown paint for my pop. But. D did she just. I'm going to strangle her with my bare hands! 
That's right. I'll make myself a new jar and tell Rot with her blood. What do you say, Leonine? Huh? That's nice, but it's not my problem. So that's why she got banned from this clinic. <sighs> hmm, do you want my remaining entire want? Well, I don't need so much anyway. You can have it. Yes. Thank you. You brought it back, Lenny. You're the best. It was nothing. So, do you want to help me out with my experiment? Please don't blow this place up. I won't. Hmm. The princess should be getting up around this time. I should go back to my room in case she needs me for anything. Ah, <sighs> okay. Time to save. 